or if you just want to do something simple and you don't want to put much effort into your hair this video is perfect for you you can use your what's up youtube and welcome back to my channel my name is sydney and if you're new here hey y'all i am back at it again with another video for y'all as y'all can see by the title i have a bun tutorial for you guys you guys have been requesting for me to do a bun tutorial because you guys are always like oh my god i love your buns oh my gosh how do you do that with your hair the wait is over i decided to do a tutorial for you guys since you guys wanted this ever so badly i will be doing different kinds of buns for you guys these are really quick and easy hairstyles that you can do if you're running late it is good for if you're on the go or if you just want to do something simple and you don't want to put much effort into your hair this video is perfect for you but first before we get into the video if you are not subscribed to my channel already go ahead and subscribe and comment down below future videos you would like to see because i am here for y'all all 2019 all 2020 and that's period go ahead and follow my socials they will be on the screen for you right here y'all can go check me out on instagram and twitter anyways let's just hop into the video i don't need to ramble anymore first bun i will be showing you is the fan bun because it doesn't like a good fan bun so all you're gonna need is a brush so you're just gonna take your brush and brush your hair up you're gonna take one of your hair ties three times around and one more so you're going to pull the bun through and from here what you're going to do is pull it out and that is how you get your fan bun from here what i like to do sometimes i like to pull out a couple of hairs and of course you don't want to be just looking like this so that's what i have to flat iron for i'm just gonna flat iron the little pieces that way they're slick baby straight you do the same to the other side all right so i like to do that and then of course we're never done we're never gonna leave our edges like that looking all rough so i take my eco and a handy dandy toothbrush i just zip in the gel and swoop like i said nothing too crazy just something to finish off this simple look have you right as you can see like up close what it looks like you do the same thing to the other side all right so we have our edges done we finished off that look and if you want to you can add a scrunchie on top but I am just gonna leave it like this this is the fan bun this is the first bun look what I also like to do is take a little twist on the bun. I like to keep the fan bun as is. And from here, I just like to gather it a little bit to make it like a little tighter. And then we're just gonna add a scrunchie on top of it. All right, and now you have a cute little, I don't know what to call this bun, but it's just like a cinched version of the fan bun. As you can see, nothing too crazy, but it's still cute and simple and it looks so good with the scrunchie. So I figured, why not? For the next bun, we are going to take our brush. We're gonna take our brush and do the same thing. We're just gonna brush straight up. You can center it wherever you want to on your head. It does not matter. For this, I'm going to do the same thing. Take my hair tie and wrap it all the way around about three times, that way it's secure. Just like that. And from here, now we're just going to twist and we're going to wrap and add your scrunchie on top. Now you have like a little, not like a top knot, but I see some people do these type of buns. They're like just little, it looks like a bonbon for, I really don't know what to call this, but if you want to do this, cause I know it's super simple, super easy. Oh, it's kind of cute. Next, I have for you guys a half up, half down bun. So you're just going to take your brush again. And this time you're just going to brush your hair straight back. Make sure you get enough hair in there, but you still have enough hair to leave down. You're going to take your hair tie and wrap around about a good three times. And on the last one, you're going to do the same method as the fan bun. You're going to take it, bun it, and pull it out. And that's what gives you 
this. That's what it looks like. Okay. And it's so cute. I actually love this one. I'm probably gonna leave my hair like this later just because like I rarely ever leave my hair down. And I think today's the day that I'm just gonna do it. So I call that the fan half up, half down bun or whatever you wanna call it. It does not matter because girl, you cute anyways. Next, we're gonna do the same thing, but this time we're gonna do the twisting method. So you're gonna wrap around three times. Twist your hair, wrap it around and secure it with another hair tie using a scrunchie. If you don't want to fan it in the back, you can just do a simple bun like this and be looking like Belle and you're so cute. Next, we're going back in with that same brush cause girl, you ain't done. We are doing the same half up, half down look, but we are gonna place it a little bit higher on our heads. Make sure, like I said before, you leave enough hair down. You want it to be proportionate and you don't want to be looking like the Cynthia ragdoll because that's just not it, sis. From here, you're going to place this further on top of your head. Take your hair tie, wrap around a good three times two and three. Now you're going to do the same twisting method. You're going to twist beautifully, twist. Now I'm gonna go in with my scrunchie and secure the bun. This one is honestly so adorable, so cute and so easy. These literally take all of five seconds. Like you don't even have to try to be cute anymore. Sis, like you're just that girl. You're that snatched and it takes you all of, like I said, five to seven seconds to do one of these hairstyles. These are perfect when you're running late or on the go or whatever the circumstance may be. These are just super cute. And like I said, really easy. And why not? Like, why not do it? Next, we are going to do a low bun. So same thing applies. You're just going to take your brush. I'm going to show you guys a couple of different ways to do these. So first way is just like a pullback, just like this. See, I have no parts down my head. I just brushed straight back. And now I'm going to wrap around three times. And on the last one, I'm just gonna pull it through to give me a little bun in the back. And that's what you get when you do that. All right, in our next one, we are actually gonna be parting our hair this time. This one is a little bit more time consuming, so if you have more time and you want to do this, feel free. This one, we are going to go straight down the middle. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with a harder brush to really make sure that I get my hair nice and flat. I'm going to wrap around a good three times. And on that third one, I'm just going to let it sit in a bun and this is what you get. I go on with the eco gel and I like to redo my edges. So I'm gonna take my gel, repeat the edge process, and I'm gonna repeat to the other side. Okay, and now we have a completed bun look. This is a slick bun straight down the middle, middle part, down the back, whatever you wanna call it. It takes about like, this is like a three minute thing still doesn't take long still good for when you're on the go but if you're running late i wouldn't suggest do this because it does take a little more time last but not least we are going to do the side part you're going to go in with your comb again this time you're going to part it on the side yep just like this go back in with your brush brush out that middle part get that out the way and for this you are going to need gel i'm going to take a little bit of the gel just a little bit and put it on this side, make sure it's all slick and right. That way we know for sure it stays down and you won't be looking a hot mess cause that's not what it is. I'm going back in with my hard brush again. I'm gonna brush everything back like I've been doing. And this time I'm going to put this bun more on the side of my head just cause you can do whatever you want. Sometimes I like to do on the side. So that's what I will do. Here's my bun, I'm going back in with Gel. We are going to make sure everything is slick and smooth. Make sure this side is extra slick and put together just like that. And now we are going to the other side and we're going to just do our edges like how we've been doing. Just something super simple, easy, nothing crazy. And there you have your slick back side. What are you doing? How are you doing? Get out. You know, leave leave 
Leave. I just woke up. And, um, I just wanted to see what you were doing, but... I'm not worried. Alright. Okay. Get! Go! All right, so there you have it. There is my slick back side ponytail, well, side bun with a side part. And I even did the edges for y'all because you know I got you. I ain't gonna leave you on the wind, leave you hanging or whatever, like anything like that or whatever. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Future videos you would love to see me do in the future for you or other tutorials you would like me to do for you guys. Comment down below your favorite hairstyle that I've done for you guys in this video. By the way, I made this scrunchie. It's like, it actually came out cute. I follow this DIY. I can leave that in the link below. If you want to make your own scrunchie, hey, so be it. If you don't even like scrunchies, save the turtles. I hate that so much. Why did I just do that? Irrelevant. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I love you guys so, so much. And I'll see you on the next video.